Hi Ernabees, it's Sandy. Um, I just wanted to come and say hello. <coughs> yes, I am in my house coat and I sound like crap. I have a cold. <coughs> no, it's not the coronavirus. Um, <coughs> but uh, I wanted to give you a little update and I haven't been on here in a while because I just haven't been feeling well. Um, yeah, having a head cold sucks, <clears throat> but anyway, um, I obviously cannot go to the hospital to see my sister, um, so I've been getting updates from my niece, and she, my sister has, um, woken up, she's coherent again, the fluid in her brain has, um, come down again. So, and we found out that it's not an infection. So that's good. <clears throat> um, so in about a week's time, they're going to put her back in surgery and uh, put the permanent uh, tube in her brain. So, and it just really sucks because now I'm sick and I can't go anywhere near her. Um, and it really breaks my heart. So, but I would much rather be here and not infecting her because um, she is in a very vulnerable state right now. She still has the, the tube in her brain to uh, relieve the fluid. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, <coughs> she has been texting me, uh, but the, the texts are kind of a little off. I have to kind of, it's like a puzzle trying to figure out what she's trying to say. Um, so, uh, yeah, every time I try to ask her how she's feeling, she's not responding to that. So I have to rely on my niece to tell me. Um, what else? So I've been basically sitting here, I've been in bed for the last couple of days. <clears throat> Today is the first day that I kind of feel human, but I got all this going on now, and now I'm losing my voice. So it's not in my chest. It's not like I don't have a fever. I don't have all the symptoms of Corona, so I think I'm good. <laughs> um, so I've been trying to crochet, but I just feel like I'm, I've got nothing done. I was in the process yesterday of trying to make a... Um, a vest, a long vest, and I got that far and I said, no, I'm not going to do it. I, I just can't. I don't have the mental capacity right now. So I made it into a cowl instead. So, uh, so there you go. I made it into a cowl. <coughs> but it's the, uh, I don't know what you call it, a fan stitch or something. So, <clears throat> so I just kind of went, ah, make it in a cowl and be done with it. <laughs> um, what else? Uh, I have been watching videos. Um, I'm intently watching Laura um, <clears throat> and finding out if her chicks are hatched. Um, I'm not commenting on anything really, but I am watching. Um, I've been watching Lisa from Lisa's Crochet uh, and her cowls. She's going cowl crazy. It's like, wow, that's awesome. <clears throat> um, yeah, so uh, I did what I was part of, um, what was it? Was it Sandy's Live? Yeah, I was part of Sandy's Live for a little bit. <clears throat> You know, so I am, I am out there watching you guys, because what else am I going to do, right? I'm sitting here, I'm starting to lose my crojo, <clears throat> because I just, I'm just not feeling up to doing it. Um, but I, I've got so many things I want to do, but I start doing it, and I just go, Ugh. but, yeah, um, <clears throat> the, uh, the package that I got from Rosalie from Yarded Out, 
uh, I'm supposed to be starting to make the tea, uh, teapot cozy. I started that. I got like four rows in and went, uh. <laughs> so um, I may do some of that today. I don't know. But yeah, being sick sucks. Sucks bad. I have all this yarn around me. And I have no Crojo. <laughs> it's not very often I don't have Crojo. Um, but yeah, this one's kicking my butt. And my finger, I don't know, the newbies won't, won't know, but um, uh, last summer, was it? I can't remember. But anyways, my knuckle, my, my knuckle on my index finger cracked really, really bad. I thought it broke my finger, but I think I may have uh, maybe chipped a little piece of cartilage or something because every once in a while I can't bend my finger and the pain is excruciating. And um, if I pull on my finger, you can feel it kind of go click in and then it feels okay. But um, when that pain starts, it's like, oh, it just paralyzes my finger. <clears throat> so then I can't crochet, right? So I have to rub it and and try and get it to go get working again. So that really sucks. But uh, yeah, I wanted to do some tutorials, but I can't do it with this freaking voice, right? Uh, I guess I could put subtitles on it, but that sucks. I hate watching videos that have subtitles, right? But that's just me. Um, so. You guys tell me what you think. Should I do a tutorial and just put the subtitles? <clears throat> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is bad. Maybe I shouldn't have made a video today. I don't know. <laughs> oh man. Um, yeah. So anyway. I haven't even been able to go to the mailbox. Uh, it's Saturday today, so it's not even open anyway, but um, maybe I'll get George to go and go and check that for me on Monday. Um, I'm trying to think of uh, just little projects I can do that don't take a lot of time, that don't take a lot of brain power, you know, and uh, amigurumi is not it. <laughs> um, just something that I can do, so I think I'm, you know, so I, I just feel like I'm doing something productive. Um, yeah, I don't know. Well, maybe you guys can suggest something. Um, but anyways, so I just wanted to touch base with you guys and let you know what's happening with my sister and me and, and everything. Um, and yeah. So I'm quarantined myself, really, um, because I was, I've been reading up a lot about the coronavirus and uh, they were saying that some people, like if you got a cold, um, you shouldn't be around people because that opens the door to coronavirus, right, because your immune system is down. So, um, yeah, I don't need that in my life. Thank you. <laughs> So, uh, anyway, okay, I'm going to let you guys go. This was a very short video. Uh, my throat's starting to fade here pretty quick. And I will talk to you guys later, okay? Okay, bye. <laughs>